Hi, I'm Sarah, and today I'd like to talk to you about combined heat and power, also known as CHP. So what is it? Well, it's not a big power plant located miles away from your facility. Those things lose about 70% of their fuel energy to the atmosphere, meaning that only about 30% actually gets delivered to the customer. CHP, on the other hand, squeezes out every bit of energy from the fuel source while capturing as much heat energy as possible. So it's kind of like the heating system on your car. Your car engine's coolant is used to heat your car. Well, we take the engine's coolant and use it to make hot water, which is then used for heating or cooling depending on your facility's needs. Now we can make the system even more efficient by installing what's called a stack waste heat recovery system, which basically traps heat in an exhaust pipe and is then used to create even more hot water or steam. So it's not uncommon to see CHP systems achieving efficiencies in the 80% range, whereas power plants float around the 30%. So why is this important? Well, experts project that electricity costs will skyrocket, while natural gas costs will remain relatively low, which means that by selecting CHP as a potential energy solution, facilities can position themselves to lower their overall energy costs, making them more competitive in their markets. So the net effect is low cost, reliable energy that allows companies to better control their long-term energy costs. But what about the environmental implications? Well, CHP has been shown to reduce carbon emissions, so much so that President Obama signed an executive order in August 2012, prompting industries to increase their CHP use by at least 50% by the end of 2020. So in addition to producing electricity efficiently, the system also recycles heat back into your facility. Bottom line, you get free thermal energy, you get low cost electricity, and you know you're utilizing up to 90% of your input fuel energy while cutting your greenhouse gases and carbon emissions in half. So what's the catch? Well, not all facilities are a good candidate, so there are a few things to consider. First, you need a location on site to house a CHP system. You need enough natural gas on site or access to a low cost gas line. You also need electricity and thermal connections close by because running them counteracts the economic advantages. A good candidate also has high electricity costs and low natural gas costs, which is pretty much all of Northeast America, or has the ability to produce biogas. Your facility runs more than 11 hours a day and uses electricity and thermal energy at the same time. CHP is great for new facilities, additions, or renovations in place of a backup generator. The cost of the generator will be traded off against the cost of the new CHP system. Some common 24-7 natural gas facilities are hospitals, nursing homes, industrial and manufacturing plants, colleges and universities with central utility plants, casinos, and certain government facilities. Common biogas facilities include wastewater treatment plants and animal farms. So what are the overall benefits? Well, you get lower electricity costs, free heat, a return on investment in as little as two and a half years, and your lights stay on even through falling trees and unpredictable weather. Because unlike above ground electrical lines, CHP uses underground gas lines. Basically, CHP allows you to harden your utility infrastructure. So you keep the lights on while others are in the dark. Even during disasters, such as Hurricane Sandy, many facilities using CHP were able to keep all or most of their lights on. Why work with us? Well, we have an extensive selection of efficient natural and biogas generators from 75 to 4,000 kilowatts. We have local factory certified technicians, local CHP specialists to provide equipment assistance and system design suggestions. And we have local parts and service. We also have a variety of financing options available through CAT. So if you wish to contact a CAT dealer, please click the contact me button below. If you want to take a straightforward, no pressure assessment to determine if CHP is economically right for you, simply click the assessment button below. If it gives encouraging results, send us the info and we'll get you started. And thank you for tuning in.